Okay, folks, hello and welcome to another slow and steady Sunday in the graveyard with the game of Crone. <laughs> I was like, I don't... Angel always has these amazing intros where he recaps what's gone on before. Like, he has this whole thing all planned out. And I think, all right, I'm going to say something interesting when I start the stream today and all I have is hello and welcome, blah, 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 blah. Let's fucking play the game. Like, <laughs> and Angel is in fact here. Hello, Angel. Hello, Groovy. Angel, you don't want me to do game reviews. I, you just don't. <laughs> I'll just sit there and go, uh, I remember something about some character doing something at some point. And yes, the donkey, the donkey for Groomfy will, will happen today with the donkey. Groomfy, you have to tell me. Just entertain me. Lie, please. Tell me how much it, I tortured you the other night with my fabulous um, fucking French shit. <laughs> Just tell me. Tell me. Tell me like it made your ears bleed and stuff. <laughs> and also understand that... Um, stuff. Oh. Your ears are still bleeding! Yeah. <laughs> Thank you! Thank you so much! What I, the full sentence of, and also understand, was, also understand that if I want to grief you to this measure, I feel very fondly toward you and, and the entire Groomfy, Moomfy plan, uh, clan. <laughs> Moo, hello! Let's just fucking play the game works for you. Alright, let's just fucking play the game. Okay. So much blue. All of the blue is here. Groomfy and Angel and Moo are all blue. Da da dee da. Oh my god, is the. Oh, I thought for a second. I thought for a second the uh, the phantom d green dot was gone, but no, it isn't. Groomfy says, Moo explained to me that I totally deserve this because I'm so mean to her and it's karma. <laughs> and Moo continues, he's used to verbal annoyance equating to love. Don't worry. Okay, good. <clears throat> What the hell am I doing? All right, so it's Merchant Day, as if that matters. Um, let's see what we've got going on here. Oh, this bizarre thing that works when it wants to. And I am gathering... <sighs> okay. That in order to get the memory powder, I need to uh, talk to a bunch of people. So I'm going to endeavor to do that today. And I should also check what's happening here. Oh, right. Unearth a chest near the tavern. Jelly of incredible power. Talk to Master Alaric. Find the vampire. So Alaric and find the vampire. Those are all vampire missions. Um... Jelly of Incredible Power is Donkey Revolution. And then Jerry is just fucking Jerry. Okay. <clears throat> just, I'm, I'm contemplating where that might be. Or what that might be. And I'm also on my own private side mission here. <clears throat> I'm so sorry, you guys. Uh, I'm on my own private side mission to um, really beef up the apiary situation. And I need a whole pile of bees. 
Jamaica, actually. Okay, so we have moved in. You guys, let me explain something to you. Here's what happened this morning while I was still sleeping. <laughs> Hence when I was dreaming. Um, I, anyway, I dreamt that I was hearing my alarm clock. And it wasn't seeping in from the outside. I was just dreaming that I was hearing my alarm clock. How fucking fucked is that? God, I hate my dreams. Who does that? <laughs> and I woke up like two hours prior to when I had set my real alarm. And, you know, I woke up thinking, oh, that must have been my, it wasn't my damned alarm. It was just the alarm that I was dreaming about in my dream. Whoa. Nice. Da, 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 da. Hmm. Okay. You know what? I'm going to give him my honey because I don't feel like carting it around. Take it! Azarek, hello. Good morning. I hope you are doing well. Or afternoon, excuse me. He's talking about morning. Groomfee is saying, it is pretty fucked. The worst thing, though, is the nightmares I wake up to and I don't know if they were real or not. Like, did I actually get fired yesterday? Oh, Groomfee. <sighs> I'm sorry. You are a nightmare sufferer as well. Hmm. All right. The bird song in the morning is a wonderful addition to the sound design. Okay, I... You know, honey is nice, but I'd like dead bees, please. No. Or I guess the bees could be live. I mean, they won't be. Oh, wait, do I need bees to create hives? Because I need bees to, to honeycomb? <laughs> is, that, is that why I need bees? I'm so used to needing bees to grind them up into chaos powder. It's not occurring to me that in this case, the bees will be used as live things to make honey, with which to make honey. That's messed up. Yeah, it is 10 bees to make hives. Angel, I jumped about you as well. Also a man that I used to caretake for. Did you ever come and visit me? You must have come and visited me then. Boy! Eh. I think I've gotten everything that she can sell to me. What I'm doing here... No, I'm not talking to that guy. Um, I doubt that... The Marquis will be someone I can talk to to tell me more about the prior gra graveyard keepers, but we're gonna... Jesus Christ, dude, stand still. Stand still. Hey. But we're gonna try. Oh my God. Was this the route you wanted to take? What? What the hell was that? Hey, hey, Psst, buddy. Hey, hey. <laughs> stand still. Stand still. Watch, I'm going to cut you off the pass. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> oh, thank you. That was worth it. 
No time for regrets. To survive, we must look to the future. Right, this is a... I'm listening. Who's listening? I'm listening? Uh-huh. Yep. Yeah, okay. Yeah, all right. All right, that's great. Uh... Okay, no, it looks like we're... He's got, got nothing for me, man. So then let's... Let's go find... Uh, choo, 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 choo. We're gonna go find... The beekeeper and see if he will sell us some bees. Yo. <clears throat> Until why, why the hell am I not remember? Oh, I'm a monster. I'm trying to remember. You had to have. It was, sorry, all of the beginnings of, <laughs> of every of these sentences, sentences. There was a particular time in my life where I was a living caretaker. Um, and I am trying to call up a memory of Angel hanging out with me in that place. And it's not working, and that's frustrating. All right, fuck it. We're going to walk over to the bee, dude. Uh, let's make sure this guy's rocking and rolling still. if there's anything interesting up here now that oh god jesus christ i think there's no point if we can't burn any witches A gross fuck you The Geek Panties is here. Hello. How are you today? Today is not your early morning stream day. Yesterday is your early morning stream day. Your, your Geek Dontheon, I believe, is what was discussed as the title. I'm so looking forward to tomorrow night again. Monday nights, we have our uh, weekly Discord watch parties for um, a Kyber Shards D&D run that uh, the Geek Pantheon and Sorry BTR are participating in. And you can find it... Yeah, at this link, along with a whole pile of other fabulously informative um, and interesting videos on the topic of D&D. Actually, let me put my Discord, the Discord link up as well, in case folks have not yet hung out with us on Monday nights. Um, it is such a blast. Tomorrow will be episode 10, I believe. Right? Yes, 10 comes after 9. All right, we are going to take this and yoink it down in here. And take this and yoink it down in here. So that I can nosh if I need to. All right.
All right, beekeeper, let's go. Ten does not come after nine. If we are in base nine or eleven, says Groomfy, the engineer. Thank you, Groomfy. I appreciate the uh, the clarification. Oh, that's awesome. Geek, you're excited for people to see it tomorrow night. Oh, yay. Oh, I can't wait. Things are going well for Geek. Tonight is the Sunday stream. Right, Sunday stream is in the evening. Yes, yes. Ah, ha, ha. And I, I heard tell that there was question as to whether I had my own dice. Um, and I do, in fact, have my own dice now because I bought them, bought the set, rather, from, um, I purchased it online from Leopard 2 Aces, uh, local store looking to help support that store because, uh, they'd had a couple of break-ins recently and he said, if you guys need anything, um consider purchasing from this store or ordering from the store because we want to help keep it around so it doesn't have to close up so they're very pretty and i like them a lot and i look forward to when i get to use them all right come on man I am looking for a suspicious mound that may have a treasure of some sort underneath it, out this way. It wouldn't be on the beach proper, I don't think. Like, when does it stop being, quote, near the tavern? Nope, that's just sand. Oh, let's talk to this guy. See if he knows anything about past graveyard keepers. He does not. Da da da. See, because here, ha ha ha, this is it. And you know what? I mentioned sorry without shouting sorry out. He had his first two and a half hour. Oh shit. Oh my, look at all of us cold and, and. I can't believe it. Elite mine, 200 years old. Thanks to all the gods, ancient and new. All my sufferings have been rewarded. That's going to really hurt his jaw, don't you think? Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> oh shit, what did I say? 200 years old, huh? Huh, can I taste it? Of course not. It belongs to King Jove, and that's for me, so it belongs to me. But I'll graciously allow you to take the gold. You're so generous, your majesty. You on the old trailer. Oh, life is so wonderful. That's awesome. Good for you. Geek is saying, I'm just an old man trying to figure out TikTok on a Sunday morning. Grumble, grumble. So, yes. So, Geek, you did your first D&D &D TikTok video because apparently D&D &D on TikTok is, is a thing. So, you're looking to capitalize on that i mean that word sounds mercenary and i don't mean it that way but it was the easiest word i could find there so how did the first video go talk share oh do i have enough do i have enough goodies in here to have a, a good old graveyard fest jesus oof i don't let's just give them oh they're gonna hate this all right, I think I'm going to wait on the Graveyard Fest, seeing that I have no food for them. Okay. Um, 
Let's go downstairs. Okay. Thought you said we were gonna see you here, but that's cool. Whatever. What a fucking tease. Well, you know, put the beer upstairs. Show me your inventory. There. Okay. So, never mind all of this. Um, uh, let's see if Dig has any news about the old... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nope. Let's walk over to... Yeah, I had a um, pretty negative experience uh, when I initially, more, th more than a year ago, I guess, a um, family member had gotten very obsessed with TikTok and it left a very sour taste in my mouth about it. Um, and I watched their videos and was like, I don't understand what, like, this just seems ridiculous. And... I have discovered that there is some stuff, some content um, that is put up out by folks on TikTok that is actually really compelling. Um, so I, I'm glad that I understand what it can be. But still, ugh. All right, here we go. Paradric, I'd like to know more about the previous graveyard keepers. Well, the first keeper appeared more than 200 years ago. Wait, did we do this already? Like, with him? He was young, romantic, a dreamer, and an incredible idler. I, th I think we already talked to him about- God damn it. This is what I get for playing other games during the week. He'd spent whole days writing poems, painting landscapes, and playing his mouth organ. Right, because I read mouth organ and went, heh heh. So never mind, I'm gonna let this play out. He is saying first two got a couple hundred views. Holy shit. There's a feature called stitching where you take the start of someone else's video and then add your response to it. I spent about an hour editing a response to post today on my computer only to realize you can't stitch with pre-recorded videos. What the hell? What the? That's odd. So what I spent more than an hour doing, I ended up doing in 45 seconds on my phone with lower quality. Oh, geek. I'm so sorry. And isn't it funny that, like, the, the, this, where does that take me? What? What it? This, like, marvelous age of social media, um, makes a person your age feel like an old man. It's like if you're not 12, you're ancient. Like, I don't know how much I want teenagers influencing society. You know, it's not that I'm like anti-teenager, but I am aware that they're not, you know what, I'm going to stop talking because now I sound like I'm 75. It's just, no, like, ugh, high school musical. Who gives a shit about what's happening in high schools? <laughs> okay, just, just forget I said anything there. Yeah, yeah. All right, talk to me, hun. Chain, do you know anything about my predecessors? The other keepers? Oh, yes, the second keeper was just awful. I still remember his ugly face, his wishy whisper, and his vile laugh. <laughs> Someone even saw him cooking and eating flesh cut right from his corpses. Thank you! I was thinking you could do that! Well, it's not the right response. We were all scared of him. We hated him, and he hated us. 
go on. And when his service finally ended a hundred years ago, I was so ellipses. Oh, ellipses. Ha ha ha. Sorry, I'm not that old, of course. It's just, you know, what I've been told. And we're done. Okay, great. Awesome. What the hell happened here? Uh, I do, Look at this. Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on, hang on. This looks like this has been worn off at the edges, which I think is a brilliant little touch. Oh, look, and the stairs are kind of worn as well. Oh my God, how many hundreds of hours? The stools have a little wear on them as well, but I don't feel like that looks as effective as, as this. That's great. Okay. Da, 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 da. Wait, I've never, can I? I cannot. Geek is saying, well, High School Musical is an interesting thing. It was made by Disney to appeal to younger kids and get them into musicals. Guess who now is in their 20s and 30s taking trips to Broadway to see Lion King and Frozen on stage in the before times? <laughs> right. The kids who grew up on High School Musical, it's all part of a plan. Um. Okay. You know what? That's fair. That's very interesting, and that's fair, and okay. Yo! Every time with this fucking stupid bush. Ay, ay, ay. Should I eat berries to get berries? That seems like a... <laughs> Fuck it. I'll eat apples to get berries. F! No, but that's really interesting, Geek. Seriously? Because I, I, I have gathered that you are a knower of, of all things Disney. All right, talk to me. Pressful, do you have the time to tell me something about the other keepers? Of course not, but if it's the only way to get rid of you. The last keeper was a very decent man, quite unlike you. Asshole. I used to buy alcohol in the town and we drink it together. Geek, have we talked? Like, it was Fecret. Damn it, hold on. When he used to get drunk, it drove him crazy. It was wildly amusing. He'd always start telling old fables about talking skulls and other worlds. Ha ha! Great. Um. Yeah, there's, um, Fecrest and I grew up on theater and musical theater, and, you know, yeah, we, you should talk to Fecrest, or he should talk to you. I think he'd be really happy to talk to you about Disney and musical theatery stuff. I mean, not that I'm... Wouldn't be happy to talk to you about uh, <laughs> Disney and musical theater stuff. Um, it's just that I, I like to play uh, matchmaker with my people. And say, look, you like this and you like this. You guys should talk to each other. I feel like I'm being exceptionally weird today. <laughs> so just... Sorry. All right, who else can I talk to? So, all right, it's Astrologer Day. Let's go talk to that asshat. And let's not waste our feet on it. Balls. You are useless to me, sir. You have been an awesome disappointment any uh it's always sunny in philadelphia fans out there all right so i'm gonna go talk to tress and um the other dude
Is this this is Rosa, right? Yeah. The milkmaid. Hey. Rosa, look over there. Do you see the badger with a gun? Oh shit. Okay, here we go. Why'd you go and do that? If you hadn't intervened, I'd have had that blood sucker the next second. Or he would have dealt with you in half a second. Sorry about that. I promise it won't happen again. Good he didn't stand a chance. You saw how he was so frightened he went deaf. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great laugh. All right, this guy's got nothing. Boy, I have left a lot of holes for people to fall into <laughs> in this world. <laughs> All right, woodsman, woodcutter, wood. Okay. Woods. Jimmy Woods. Geek says, I actually had a short lived musical theater podcast. The guy who was supposed to edit the episodes didn't have time anymore and I couldn't add it to my workload. Geek, I am so sorry that that didn't continue. Oh my God, that would be really interesting. If, if only there were as much time in the world as there were ideas. You know? I, I think that's... That's how I meant to say that. Where the shit? Stonecutter. Where the fuck is he? Did it do? Oh my god, my neck is so fucked up. Okay. Yeah, okay. Oh my god, Angel, if you are... <coughs> Sorry, hold on. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> if you are still here, Shiv and I tried to play some Left 4 Dead 2 together last night obviously together not apart shit <laughs> okay and it was much more difficult as a two-person affair um i'm not entirely sure why but that was not fun <clears throat> Plus five, also plus five. Okay. Ricardinho, hello! Ricardinho, before um, I got on stream today, I saw that you had sent me um, an invite to the video, so I will check it out after stream. Thank you. Angel says, which level did you guys try? Some are harder than others, it seems. Um, I don't know. Shiv set it up, so I'm not entirely sure which map or level. Um, I know it was survival. I don't know if that's what you are asking about. Oh, you know what? Yeah. I don't want that. I want the actual... I don't need more of that, but this would be good. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> and since I run out and have more money than I know what to do with... 
with which to do what that I know. <laughs> more money than I know what to do with. With which I know what... More money than which... How does that go? Somebody write the sentence out. More money than with which I know what to do? That's, that's totally fucked. That cannot be right. More money with which then I know what... Fuck me. This is stupid. Alright, so I am attempting to speak to all of the... You know what? I'm gonna go in your shit. And also Sneed. Sneed, I remembered, is what I used to call uh, Tress. It was Sneed. I couldn't remember last week. What you guys got going on in here? What's in here? Got any needles? Looking for a needle. Just one. Right. More money than I know what to do with. I think, I mean, it's sounding weird to my ears, but that's ending, that's ending the sentence with a preposition. And so, is there a way to fix it? Oh. No, I think I'm all right. I, I will, however, steal your shit. There we go. Take your soup. I'm going to do stuff with it. It's going to be my soup, and that'll be that. Although I deeply wish I could steal your other soup. All right. Um, mm, 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 mm. All right. With which I know what to do. M more money. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Be stressing about this. Oh, God. That's, well, that's a lot of hops. Who knew? Um... I, I need a zombie, a, a mead zombie. I really do. Oh, that's interesting. I'm only down to, two. I'm down to two here. That surprises me. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah. Give me, give me all your shit. Well, isn't that something? Oh no, this is what I was doing. What am I? Oh my god, brain. Okay, how about this? Excellent. All right, let me drop off some goods here. I would like you to go here, uh, and you to go here, you to go here, and I think I need to bring some more, yes, I definitely need to bring some more water down here. <coughs> Excuse me. So, I have unearthed the treasure. Okay. Geek is taken off. Shower and then vlog filming time with the wife. Geek, have fun. Enjoy. And we may just see you later in your Sunday stream. Because tonight is Walking Dead night, right? Or is that Tuesdays? Fuck. Regardless, we may see you later in stream. <laughs> And thank you for coming by. Very much appreciated.
Okay. Uh, I need to drop this in here as well as that. Um, yep. 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 Tuesday is Walking Dead. Tonight we are chatting D&D, specifically my latest YouTube video. Okay, great. Awesome. Okay. All right. Good, 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 good. These onion rings are so quick. I'm not complaining. It's pretty awesome. Whoa. Okay. So let us put things in places. I got these specifically so that I could potentially sell them. Um, in my crates. So let's see if I can do that. <clears throat> oh my goodness. Not really with, with the others. All right, we need... Um... Which piece, which iron chisel? All right, we're going to have this guy make us some iron chisels because we are soon going to be out. Nope. Okay. All right, and it is church and day, so I will get over there. Uh, Here, right? Iron chisel. Get to it. Okay. <clears throat> like, like, but seriously, the, these things are so prolific. Now, I'm not going to, wow, this is windy. Miss the, I'm, I'm not going to go down into the cellar because I want to see if he can, oh no, it's just cathedral. So he can't give me any info. All right. Okay, let's go. Oh, who could forgot to get... Okay, weird. I did not gather my church and stuff. I must have been very full last time. Oh, I'm really appreciating how um, it's getting lighter in here. With every candle. So I'm not sure who else I would speak to regarding um regarding the memory the memory powder. Let's see who else okay, so I haven't spoken to the Inquisitor or uh who else haven't I spoken to? I haven't spoken to Snake. I haven't spoken to Miss uh, Miss Thing. Shit. 
All right. Azric is saying, have to head out and take care of some family errands. Hope to be back before you end stream. Have fun. Azric, thank you so much for the lurk. Hope your errands go well. All right, let's go. <clears throat> All right, get out. Get out. Give us your money and get out. Get out. Wow, that is a lot of people. Holy shit. Okay. Um speak to the farmer. I tried to speak to the ceramic ceramic Adam. Um, Because the refugee camp seems like it is as far along as it's going to get. So we're looking at vampires and donkey revolutions. Yeah. All right, and I have to talk to Alaric as well. Okay. Um, stolen away. She go and I can't put that honey anywhere so okay oh shit I forgot to drop off those candles fuck okay Okay, crafting it up. Ship away. This is not a lot of water. So this day is it yeah it's miss charms day okay i will try to talk to her today Ah, yes. I will, in fact, take both your money and your confession. And I'll stow it away for another day. Man, this is the most ostentatious fucking graveyard.
Hopefully, I can get a couple more bees. <clears throat> so I can make two... Damn it. Oh, no. Yes, 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 yes. Come here. Wow, that was nice. Nope, honey, useless. Two more beehives. Also useless, this is fun. God damn it. There we go. I'm gonna go over and try to murder these guys over here too. Maybe they'll give me jelly of incredible power. And that was my second B. Excellent. Okay. All right, we got two at least. <clears throat> It's interesting to me that, like, the bats and the, the jelly dudes hang out at night. I mean, during the day, rather, now. I don't think that was the case before. Pardon me. Yeah, it's just gonna give me green jelly. What? That's it? What? The fuck? Okay, I saw more of these dudes bouncing around. Uh... Alright, never mind. We are going to get our butts to Ms. Chain. Or, here we go. Come here. <laughs> nope! Charm, rather. Yep, useless. How about this chick? This backup singer. Nope. All right, then we should go to the refugee camp and talk to Alaric. <clears throat> and then tomorrow on Merchant Day, I will <clears throat> talk to the merchant. Oh, yes. Oh, this is good. I think I have enough bees to make. Yep. my final beehive. You met Ted? Let's take this out. Oop. happening oh um
Yeah, see this this jelly is just it's no different. It's just green jelly. Okay. Okay. Oh shit, that's the wrong place for this. Hold on. Also the wrong place for these. <clears throat> I don't know if it matters, but I actually I don't think it does. Oh well. Okay, so um I'm gonna go up to the apiary. Whoa. All right. Uh, one more, yes? So, God damn it. Of course. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. I'm not taking the time to walk. I'm just not. Flitch. Here, right? Okay. God's sake. And I... Right. Nope. 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 Also, why the hell am I not using the speed potion? And that is that. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's all. Done with this shit now. All right. So before we go talk to Merchant, because I'm quite sure he's not there yet, we are going to try to talk to Alaric. Why aren't they, why aren't they eating? <laughs> Eat your shit. Is this out? No. Here we go. All right. Uh, all right, let's ask about all of it. What did you do to a shepherd? Absolutely nothing. A little bump on the head. It was completely harmless. I suppose it might even do him some good. Anyway, he's at home and his wife is looking after him. Were you a vampire since you were born? Uh, no, I was contaminated over 30 years ago. 
Some vampires kidnapped me, put me in a cage, tortured me, and did this to me. Jesus. I hate my curse more than anything, but there's no cure for it. I drink blood only in the most desperate situation to avoid a terrible death. Why did you attack the villagers? I didn't want to, but I'm nearly dying of hunger. If I try to attack anyone at the camp, Theodoro would easily find me out. I remember a movie. There was a guy who drank rat blood, or he... I do not fear death, but I cannot leave this world without fulfilling my duty. What's the ancient curse? It was laid upon us two centuries ago when disciples of the new faith destroyed the ancient bridge. Departed souls could no longer find the way to the land of the dead. They grew mad in despair, returned to their bodies, and began killing everyone. The walking dead flooded the world. Uh -huh. Only the ancient god and the ancient contract saved humankind from annihilation. What is the ancient contract? It contains the list of dictates which stave off the ancient curse. It was agreed to by representatives of new and old faith and the ancient god. My brothers and I, as signatories, signatories, were obliged to follow it faithfully and execute all its conditions. We did so for nearly 170 years, but as you can see, we failed eventually. Ha! You're not even, you're even older than Moses. Not bad, Moses. I always considered it strange that graveyard keepers weren't informed of all this stuff. In the end, you're the guarantors of the contract. Why did the ancient curse return? Because the strictures of the ancient contract were violated too many times. What do you mean? The Inquisition's cruelty, the cult's brutality, the ships of the dead stuck in the harbor. And most importantly, we haven't had a graveyard keeper for the past 30 years. Your predecessor was killed before you, the next chosen keeper, were even born. There must always be a graveyard keeper. They are the guarantors of the contract. That's why I asked when we first met about the role you play. Yao Kun, hello! Good to see you! Uh, what made me come back to Graveyard Keeper was I finally finished um, the main story of GTA 5. And um, while I was playing GTA, uh, the Game of Crone DLC came out. And so I decided that when I finished it, I would come back. And so now we are pretty, pretty far into this DLC. This dropped in October, I believe it was. But it's very good to see you. All right. And how can we stop the ancient curse? The curse began to return after the Great Blast, and according to the information I have, the fourth keeper, your predecessor, had been killed in the Great Blast. So we must unmask the, oh God, the murderer of the fourth keeper. Only the person who triggered the curse can stop its spread. Well, it looks like I'll be playing Sherlock Holmes a bit more. So there's nobody else who can help with this curse? Nobody. The other signatories are bound by a seal of silence. Except for me and my brothers, but it's useless to count on them. Good on me. Why won't your brothers help with the curse? This is not the time or place to discuss them. Perhaps one day. But for now, know this. We can rely only on ourselves. I agree to help. Achieve and unlock to stop an ancient curse. I know it's not an easy decision, but it's the right one. Let's see. For starters, take these scrolls. Ooh. They'll help you. Save a lot of time traveling. <laughs> Save a lot of time traveling. Then we should. We should. We should. Master Alaric, what happened to you? Wait, I'll call the Marquis. No. no, never him. 
If he learns that I'm a vampire, he'll pierce my heart with a wooden stake with the greatest of pleasure. Look at his little chest moving up and down. Blood, just a drop of blood. Oh no, please hurry. Blood, well, I doubt corpse blood is tasty, but we're out of options. Yes, I also don't have a corpse from which to get blood because I have not. Oh, hang on. I may still have a bucket of blood. It's a good thing I saved that thing. Um, I have not been putting carrots in the donkey box. Uh, no, no, no. I'm hurrying, do you see? See, I take this very seriously. No bucket of blood here. Okay, but it might be in the basement. And I don't think I would have kept it here. No, because this is all of this and that. All right. This <laughs> is so cute. And I don't believe I would have put it here. <clears throat> yeah, it's not here. I know it's not here. I need to stop looking here. Shit, I swear to God I had a bucket of blood somewhere. Where did I have my bucket of blood? I had it. I had a bucket of blood. This does not belong here. Where the fuck? Oh, man. I mean, I can go to Clotho and say, hey, give me some fucking blood, but I, it's going to drive me bananas. All right, so it wasn't... It's not going to be up here. Also, let's make some mead while he's dying. Where the fuck? I know I had it. Oh, maybe up maybe up in my house, which would be a really fucked up place to keep it, but still. There's there's a reason I'm back here. Oh, that's right. I wanted to I wanted to put the bee away. Get out of here. How does one misplace a bucket of blood? So fucked up. All right, so oh, shit. No, ah, shit. Oh, well, I guess I needed to sleep. Am I? Okay, no blood here. It's not gonna be in here. Oh, maybe I've got it in the tavern. 
my tavern. Right, because no. 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 Yeah, it's just not gonna be in any of these places. Okay, so... I might want you to make me... This is... Let's see. Let's have you... You have not made carrots, so let's have you do this. Alright, you've got a whole thing going on. Um, <clears throat> oh, uh, maybe in the graveyard? Doubt it. Shit! The fuck! All right, let's see. What do we got going on here? What is this? Where can we go with this? Can we go to Clotho? Because that'd be... No, it's just the same thing. Okay. Um, let's go to that dead horse. <clears throat> Did I miss the opportunity to talk to him? Son of a bitch. All right. Let's go back. No, hold on, hold on. Yes, I know. All right, see you later. So why are these tele teleportation scrolls? Like, anything that I care about since I already have one. I was hoping that they would take me somewhere good. Oh, let me get rid of. I know Angel's sitting here going, Mia, you're dicking around while a man lay dying. <laughs> yeah. 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 Interesting. Fine. Nope. Alright, so I'm just gonna book it out to Clotho and get some fucking blood. And I'll try to get back in time to talk to Snake today. 
because I'm still looking for that memory powder so I can make the memory tincture. All right, all right, Jesus. Pick up grass, I'm close. Fuck! Uh. Okay. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, so much time. Oh, oh, oh. So how's everyone doing? Come on, come on, lady. Look, I'm wearing a path in her in her uh, front yard here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. I wonder if I can make a nice like circle. If I can do this, then I can go back to using an etch a sketch and make something wonderful rather than a bunch of bullshit. Oh, oh no. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome, welcome. I appreciate it. It might be an off-screen um, off follow, and that's fine, too. But it is so good to see you over here. Thank you. Oh, there you are. Hello. I don't know how you've never been on my stream before, Ona. I was thinking that. I was in my head. I was like, oh, I could have sworn. Thank you for her follower. But good to see you here. Onasaurus is someone I know through King Purpose's uh, stream. Ha um, very generously gifted me a sub to Purpose, and I believe Haseo at one point as well. So really appreciative of your generosity. Um, if you don't have too big of a gaming backlog, uh, we do all followers are eligible to um, enter a weekly Humble Bundle game giveaway that I put on and we draw the winners today so you can uh enter that if you'd like by hitting exclamation point raffle all right she already told me all about this okay so so hold up so speed potion is very important but also blood i know she so she doesn't have blood oh my god why did i think i could get blood from her Well, useless, madam. You are useless to me. Just, okay. Why did I think I could buy? Is it because, I wonder if it's because I thought. Uh, I was thinking about the fact that she has speed potion. God damn it. Damn it. Well, you, you have been an utter disappointment. Thanks for nothing, Clotho. Here, you know what? I'm going to wear even... Even more of a, get your, get your fucking tiller to fix this up. Yeah. Yeah, look at this. You are going to be tripping over these tracks come the rainy season. <laughs> so mad. <laughs> you can't squeeze blood from a crone, says Angel. You know, you never know until you try. This is stupid. I'm mad. Okay, so, fuck. Okay, hold on. Who else needs talking to? Hold on. Um, what's his bucket? Uh, Grumpy. Grumpy Snakey Poo. Let me go downstairs and talk to that asshole. Hold on. <laughs> Wait. Ah! Oh, I've slowed down. Patekin, hello! <laughs> How are you? Shout out for Patekin. So Patekin, will you be returning to Monsieur Larry of the Leisure Suit tomorrow? Because I'm gonna try the um I'm gonna try the audio only thing. That you all suggested and see if that works for my phone. Okay. All right, Snake, Snake, gotta go talk to Snake. 
Snake, snake, snake! Don't you go anywhere. Hey. Hey, snake, snake, snakey big grump. Hey. No, what? Useless! Also useless! Might I siphon some of your blood from your blood fountain? I did make them for you. It's bullshit. What a bunch of bullshit. All right. Well, I'm glad I got the carrots going so that donkey will bring me dead bodies so that I can get the blood from them. But before I do that, I got to give this guy a little bit of a wallop because he likes it. Hi. Oh, am I taking health off of him? Hold on. This is kind of fun. Nothing. Just absolutely nothing. Fine. No, I already know about this. See ya. All right, you know what? I'm going to my tavern, having a little party. We're gonna get drunk for a minute while I wait for carrots to grow so I can feed a donkey so he can bring me dead bodies so I can pull the blood out of it and give it to, I don't even, oh, a vampire. This fucking game. You working? Hey, what's going on, buddy? You working? How you doing? Can you work well with me looking over your shoulder like this? Hey, what do you think? How about on this side? Hey, 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 I have a secret for you. You're my zombie slave. You may think that you're sentient, but I just made you that way. All right. More onion rings for the party, please. Gonna go here, take this thing here, pop on over to the talking skull. What's up? Give me money. Thank you. Do, 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 do. Actually, tell me again about the alcohol and the pallets, about reputation and events. Okay, nothing else I need to know there. Um. Blood is not here? No. Give me this. Why, why is this even down here? I'm sure I used it for something. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, dry as a bu fucking bone down here. Okay. All right, let's go. We're going to do a whole thing. Hmm. Do we want one graveyard fest? Oh, we haven't done a comedy thing. Here we go. Deacon's doing well, just chilling, and he will be playing. Um, wait, why pay a vet over and over again if you can just pay a taxidermist once? Oh my god, that's horrific! I had a difficult childhood until I was seven. Thought my name was back off. Years ago. I used to divide people into two piles. And then they put me in jail. <laughs> I like that one. And then they put me in jail. Well done. Look at this. Look at these faces. Fuck you guys. We're having another event. We're holding a rat race. I lied. We're holding a graveyard fest. Okay. Wow. That sucked. Great. They ate all my food. I'm happy about that. Okay, but still. <sighs> that that was a nice little diversion. Now we got to get back home and get some blood moving. So, seriously though, um... 
still gotta figure this out. I've got to look more closely into what I can concoct in my um, alchemy lab. All right, so I need more nails. Let's get this guy making nails. Come here, put, craft. <laughs> I was gonna say nail me. Oh my God, Mia. Bad Mia. I need a number that's that's gonna look that's gonna feel good. Can we get to an even five hundred? Ah, oh, gross! Fuck it, we're doing it. Five hundred and four. Yuck. Hurry up with the carrots. Oh, jeez. Ona, have you seen? By the way, is it okay for me to call you Ona? Because I know your full name is Onasaurus. But Purpose calls you Ona. So I just... That's... That's in my... <laughs> that's in my... It's like calling somebody a nickname without... Without, uh knowing them anyway ona is just fine good okay yeah do you know about this whole freaking thing the whole grenade thing here's my response to the grenade the 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 laughable uh question was then in my opinion justified by the following clip and then, of course, there wound up being a third clip, which continued the saga and made it a trilogy. Which, let's see, do I have this set up? Yeah, I have gotten tortured for asking whether grenades go up for how, how many months now, Angel? How many years? Let's see if I can make this. Is that there? Shit. No. I never put it in as a command. But the whole saga is in my little golden moments collection. Oh my god, with the waiting! I'm just gonna stand here. Hey. The other guy. The other guy could work really well with me looking over his shoulder. Hey. Hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? When are you going to be done? Are you almost done? Do you really think you're working as quickly as you, you could be? Hey. Hey. Is this bothering you? Hey. Hey. Pay attention to me. Look. Hey. Yay! Thank you. 39. What is with these numbers? All right. Now, bring me bodies. Get this all ready. Okay, so I have talked to Charm, Chain, Horadric, the Astrologer. Um, Bishop. Merchant, no, I haven't actually gotten to talk to Merchant. Um, Snake, I've I've talked to. And this is, wait, is this Inquisitor Day? Yeah, 
Let's let's go talk to this guy. Hi, hi, hi. All right, you have something to say. Month senior, how is your audience? Terrible. These dark organs mean nothing to him. He said it didn't prove anything. What fools they are. While we do nothing, the curse continues to grow in power. <laughs> Soon enough, it'll be too late to do anything about it. I know you and I have had some hard times. But you know, for the first time, I am humbly asking for your help. Oh, are you? In the name of the family I've lost. Oh my god. Please tell me if you know of anything that can be used as evidence of witchcraft, or the undead, or any other cult stuff. Um, shit. No, I'm not gonna bring you fucking Jerry. And I want, I'm not going to do this. I'm going to, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm going to sell out the snake. He irritates me. Yay, dead body. That's exactly what we need. They planning to hold a dark ritual soon. Great. We'll catch them after the ritual. All right, but did that do anything? Did that advance my purposes in a way, in any way, shape, or form? No. All right. Oh, oh no, you like you like the grenade stuff? Good. I'm glad. Brian, hello, hello, hello. How are you doing today? I hope things are moving along with the uh with the car situation. All right. Give me this. We're gonna do stuff. Come here. Come here. I need your blood. Come here. That is what I want. Of course, I will, in fact, take all of the other things as well. Because I can. It's so unfair that the other graveyard keepers were able to eat up raw flesh, or at least one of them was. It's just too unfair. All right, good enough. Actually, before I... Hold on. Now that we've done the whole... No? Nope. Okay. Yeah, see you later. Blurp. No! Put means put. Put doesn't mean drop. Then Okay. Now, of course, I'm going to take my time reorganizing everything. I was in such a rush. Now that I've got the blood, there's no real hurry. Um, why am I here? This, is, this isn't at all what we're... I wanted to go. Yes. Okay, so you have your dad's truck for a while. Yes, yes, yes. But there's something else going on? Yeah, what's up? Oh, gold powder. That's good. Fuck. Um, yeah. Pumpkin soup. Stolen pumpkin soup. The best kind. I wonder if I can... Can't. And also, before I f use the last one, I'm wondering if I can distill... No. That would have surprised me if I could pop it in there, but that's okay. All right, let's grind this shit up. Do I know what it, what kind of powder is this? Life powder. Oh, boring. Uh, 
I know I'm going to forget that I need that drop of blood to give to Alaric, and I am going to friggin' just go, oh, speed potion, I've got blood now, and then use it up and then terrible things. All right, bunch of life powder I didn't need. Death powder is always good though. <clears throat> Although apparently I didn't need that either. White powder, gold powder. Okay. Nope, nothing. Don't use the blood, Mia. Save the blood, Mia. Oh, good. That's good. God, it is, it's just so much silver hoppiness, okay? Can you make me some gold beer, please? All right, thank you. Did it do? Okay. I can't believe I'm almost through all of my bronze onions. Okay. So get rid of this. Get rid of this. Grind up the flesh like a person does. It's perfectly normal. I don't know why anyone would think it would be weird to pull human flesh out of a dead body and uh, grind it up and... Whoops. Bake it, put it in burgers. I think it's very, very economical is what I think. Okay. <clears throat> I'm so sorry, you guys. I don't know what's happening with my throat today. Uh, let's go up here, get to the refugee camp, get this drop of blood in old Master Alaric here. Hopefully he's not dead already. Hey, I got something for you. Here's blood. I unlocked the blood supplier achievement. There, that's a bit better, but the taste is amazingly foul. What was it? Corpse blood. Or were you counting on me to ask some villager to volunteer his blood? Oh no, not again. <laughs> Hello, diarrhea, but you're right. Thank you, in spite of it all. In spite of it all? If you wish, I can- No! No! I can bring you some regularly so that you can stop bothering the villagers. Oh my god. Uh, it's a deal and paying you for this service would be the honest thing, wouldn't it? Okay, I have something for you right now. It's my old vampire sun cream. Sun cream for vampires. You can show it to them as an evidence of the vampire's demise. Then the villagers will stop worrying, and you'll get your reward. One thing I don't need is money. What I need is to reach the end of my to-do list. Thank you. May I ask, why did you say Teodoro would be glad to kill you? Because it's true. But that is one of those burdens that cannot be shared. You passed out and never finished your thought. Ah, uh, yes. Yes? You must find the vampires who captured and tortured me 30 years ago. I remember. They asked me about the ancient contract and the ancient curse. I'm sure they're somehow connected to the curse and the great blast. Where should I start looking? Do you have an address? I don't know. They sort of disappeared after the great blast. So the trail is cold. Let me think. 
astrologer told me that he and the fourth keeper were attacked by vampires. Some strange magic turned their attack attackers to vampire jaws. Maybe it's possible to find these jaws and disenchant them? I've heard of this place. I should inform Alaric. I know where we could start looking, but that event happened so long ago. Any clue must be long gone. That's not a great problem. Oh, ho, ho! Borrow the witcher's eye from Teodoro. I have it, I have it. It's a special artifact for discovering things which are shrouded in the veils of time. Aren't you coming with me? I'm still too weak from hunger, and daylight is deadly to me. Hmm, well, I'll tell you if I find anything. Oh my god. Don't hold out for gratitude. Just be glad that they're not throwing stones at you. Goodbye. This is ridiculous. Okay, that's awesome. I can use the Witcher's Eye now to check the area to the right of the waterfall. Um, still got to get that jelly of incredible power. Um, and then bring the vampire sun cream over to Horadric as evidence that the vampire is dead. Okay. My god. Witcher's eye. Shit. Okay. Why don't I just go to the waterfall myself? I mean, I'm going to go to the waterfall myself and let us see. Uh, no, two. Waterfall's up here, right? No. There it is. Because this is not it. This is just clay. Or sand, rather. Nope. I, I'm, I'm guessing that I need to actually use the Witcher's Eye to do it. That simply going here will not work. Oh! Okay. Hmm, it looks like just the place. They were here. The young astrologer and the fourth keeper. The eye is trembling. Why am I thinking about unicorns? What the fuck now? What is this? Examine. What the fuck? Then Keeper tried to catch a moth. I could see myself doing that, but he caught a huge hornet. Uh-oh. What is happening? They were playing dice right here. Keeper was cheating and astrologer lost his shirt, then his pants and his underwear. Go on. This is so weird. They lit a fire and fried a fish. Hmm, I've never heard of poisonous fish around here. Is really just so damned weird. Then Keeper made a cocktail, missing, mixing four types of alcohol in one flask. Oh my god! Oh, laws. Oh, whoa, whoa, hey, ho. There's Keeper and Astrologer. There's Keeper and Astrologer daring each other to drink their hellish cocktail. Oh my god. Whoop. Nope. Hey. Here, they're singing serenades and embracing each other.
That's where Astrologer vomited. Twice. Ew. Then Keeper knocked the flask over, then fell over himself, and... Wait! This is the weirdest game. The screenshot ability is, is very low here, but I need something for my thumbnails, my video thumbnails. There are four vampires attack them right here. Some sort of magic turned them into jawbones. And bingo, one of those jaws, it's still here in the ground. All right, let's do it. It looks like that's it, but I can't stop thinking about naked, raven-haired women riding unicorns. Wow! I think the witch Clotho could disenchant this jawbone for me. Okay. Wow! What a development. My goodness. Um, mm, let's see if we can get to her in time. Oh, donkey. And I'm seeing that uh, Brian and Angel are talking back and forth there. And I want to check it out. Um, and I will do that after. I oh, shit. Wow, a whole squad of soldiers this year. 33 guys in black and orange uniforms. And Inquisitors with them. He gives them an inspiring speech and sends them to, to capture Clotho. The Inquisitor waits for an hour, killing mosquitoes and flies with a huge gilded buck. The Inquisitor departs, accompanied by 33 black and orange clad frogs. That's great. Yeah, Clotho was having none of it, which is pretty awesome. Hey, lady. You're cool. Hey, can you do this thing? Clotho, I have a jaw. I'd like you to turn it into a vampire. This is so fucked up. Why, certainly, sweetie. Open your mouth. Stop. I meant this other jaw. It's an enchanted vampire, and I need you to disenchant it. Oh, that's even easier. Let me see. Hmm, interesting. Its aura is so bright. I'm afraid I can't dispel such powerful magic, my boy. I'm sorry. What the fuck? Arg, I was really counting on you. Are you sure there's nothing we can do here? Hmm, well, of course. You could always try one thing, a memory tincture. Yes? Okay. Great, I'd be really grateful. Okay, here we fucking go. Finally. I must warn you, one of your predecessors, the third keeper, used memory tincture several times. He told me it's unstable, unreliable, and has several side effects. If there's any hope it'll work, it's worth trying. By the way, you'll need... And here it is. You'll need some memory powder for preparing the tincture. Here's a pinch. If you need any more... You're welcome to it. It's 20 years past its expiration date. Oh, one more thing. If you meet that lovely woman who purchased a recipe for emulsion of death, please remind her that she has forgotten to take her change. Okay, thanks, Clotho. Yeah, give me more. Okay, awesome. Grab a couple more of these. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Okay. Let me, um, what am I doing? Oh. 
Oh. Hold on. Let me get one more from her. And now I know how to make memory tincture, which is probably a bad thing. Man, that was loud. Yes, a burger, please and thank you. Let's, let's take a little nap. All right, so I'm gonna read this here. Okay. Uh, so Brian's saying four years ago, my, the, in the last place I lived, oh my God, you're getting sued for back rent, Brian? Angel saying, check your local tenancy laws. You're almost certainly outside the statute of limitations. Sounds like a shakedown to me. How's your li- Hold on. I heard that the graveyard keeper is an extraordinary individual. But nobody warned me that he's also a handsome man. And your beard is so, so long, so attractive. It calls out for me to touch it, to immerse my fingers in it. Well, er... Thanks. It's unusual to hear such words coming from an inquisitor. Fuck! My headset is dying. Does it surprise you that a beautiful and intelligent woman can be an inquisitor? It does. It does. It surprises me. I don't like it. See for yourself, my dear. Not all female inquisitors are lonely, bitter, ugly old hens. I unlock the one more inquisitor achievement. Great. Her voice is hypnotic, and her eyes, it's, I feel naked, it's awful. May I know your name and the purpose of your visit? I, I cannot. Oh, I adore direct men, Lady Beatrice, and I am looking for someone. Someone who, what's that disgusting smell? Is that corpses? Lady, you have a lot of fucking nerve. This is my fucking place. Don't perfume it up. Yeah, please stop doing that. It smells unbearable. I would prefer baked corpse meat. Thank you. What? It's a revolutionary, unique freshener. Really? You prefer the smell of corpses? Yes. Definitely. At least it doesn't make my eyes water. How disappointing. I had hoped on a more arousing encounter perhaps next time sorry you didn't say who are you looking for heretics sentenced to the holy fire they escaped from prison and fled town oh shit with the help of an inquisitor who betrayed his faith and his god i'd love to help but i don't know anything about it Don't worry, my dear. You have already helped. Oh, shit. Hey, what was that? I smell strange. Dried cloves and lilies beautifully combined with the smell of rotting corpses. A new goddamn task. I just can't even with all of these tasks. All right, wait. So, all right. Um, Angel is saying, has your landlord ever sent you a certified letter notifying you about the missing rent or is this the first you're hearing about it? And Brian is saying, this is my first time seeing the letter. Angel is saying, if it were me, I would respond to a certified letter by writing back to the state that my rent was paid in full and that she had agreed with that conclusion for the preceding four years. She has absolutely no case. And if it wasn't a certified letter, I would stamp it, stamp it return to sender, and forget about it. Either way, this sounds like a desperate money grab with absolutely no legitimacy. The, oh, yeah. Yeah, Angel. I, I appreciate your, your sharing all of that input. Because it really, the, 
the amount of scam that is out there in the world is really terrifying. <clears throat> and to see people getting scammed is just, yeah, boo. And, um, Brian is saying, yeah, Angel, I looked it up and they have one year to ask for back rent. And Angel's saying, yep, here's what happened. Your former landlord is right on, is tight on money because of the pandemic. So she's trying to scare old tenants into paying money they don't owe. Burn the letter and forget about it. Angel, I love you. And I'm right there with Angel, Brian. Same, same, same. Um... And Angel is saying, uh, with respect to the game, the amount of story in Graveyard Keeper is great. I love that they've expanded the lore so much with their expansions. Absolutely. Um, just yes. Yes to that as well. All right. So, okay. I don't even know what to be doing here. Let me... Where? Oh, you know what? Yeah, let's make some pumpkin soup. I'm enjoying the stolen soup. Uh, let's put the sand away. Sand is not here. Okay. Yeah, it's so disgusting. People trying to take advantage in a, in in this situation or ever. It's disgusting ever, but ugh. I'm glad you brought it to our attention, Brian, so that Angel could help you out. Oh, I've slowed down. Okay. Look at the look at the wheat blowing in the wind. Ah. It's so good. Okay. So let me, um, mm, 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 mm. so very, very many things need doing. Hey, <laughs> give me! Jerk. I had a bucket of blood somewhere. I don't know how a person... Misplaces blood, but shit. All right, good enough. I'm going to hold on to the blood to give to Alaric. Um, we're, we're going to go and check out uh, whether we can make the memory tincture thing. And then we will absolutely 1,000% go to the inn and bring our... Uh, oh, shit. Okay. Damn. Vampire sun cream to him. I think this is enough. Yeah, you guys, I really am, uh, the sense of community, the, the community that we're growing here is is not a small thing for me. I'm just thinking about, you know, Brian bringing this dilemma to us and, and Angel helping him out. And uh, I really appreciate that we are 
bringing together a really awesome group of people that is is looking to support each other and not bring each other down um and and the outpouring of generosity the other night with the hype train like it was it's so easy to be on the other side of the hype train where you're part of the generosity being given rather than received because you know how wonderful it feels to to break someone's brain um but by giving to them in such an amazing way and that happened to me the other night and it was just really really overwhelming and i'm just i i'm very excited that we are cultivating such a wonderful community and speaking of the wonderful community i want to put the discord link up just in case other folks may want to uh check it out if they are not already members of the sandbox uh, discord server we have monthly marathon watch parties um, of various types. We are doing weekly watch parties of the Geek Pantheon's uh, Kyber Shards D&D campaign. Um, and we have been having a lot of fun with that. Those happen on Monday nights. And it's just so damned entertaining um, and wonderful to watch this this campaign unfold before our eyes it's just a real delight and we've got a lot of awesome channels um for various purposes like pets channel of course but also a channel for art where people can share their art um and people have been very supportive there like that is a very risky thing to share your art and people have been awesome about it um we we it was suggested that we create a channel for if you're struggling with something, um, you can reach out there and that's already started to happen. And it's just, it's just so damned great. Like it starts with let's watch people play video games and then turns into this community of family. Um, that is just so good. It makes me very proud and grateful. Right. But seriously, folks, where might one make Well we'll go through all the desks and find out where one might make this this memory tincture. Well, here's where I can make a bucket of blood. That's nice. <clears throat> but that's not it. Oi! <laughs> Come on, Mia! Jesus Christ! The fuck? Okay, zombie juice, energy lift, spices, paint. I might not have health solution. Uh, white paint. Nope. <gasps> da 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 Boom! Memory fucking tincture, bitches! Yes, sir! Alright! Alright! Alright, so hold on. <laughs> I'm sorry, this is very exciting. Um, no, 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 no. New, 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 new. Make, uh, make the health whatever. This is... Make health potion. This is not a make health potion place. Hey. Come here. Get here. And get cracking on shit. Yeah. Pick up grass, sure. Off you go. Get to it. Oh, let me add something to here. Let me, I want to get rid of this jelly. 31 jelly is gross, so. There, now it'll be 30 jelly. Ah, mm, better. Okay, uh, now I have this. What does one do with it? Now.
Oh, shit balls. Donkey has, has slowed, uh, slowed in his purpose here. Uh, I am interested in the fact that despite the carrots, he has slowed down with the body delivery. I'm okay with it. I'm just intrigued. All right, still working on wheat. Did I do this again? Every damn time with this. This is bullshit. I'm not cutting down this tree because then I'm going to have to deal with the logs. Fuck you. Oh, God. It's so frustrating. Hold, please. <laughs> Still hold, please. I, it's so dumb. It is so dumb. You know what we need to do, Angel? We need to take a poll. How many times is Mia going to get herself stuck in the environment? It's so dumb. <laughs> Give me more fucking whatever. Give me, give me some pumpkin soup, goddammit. I'm mad. Fucking dumb. It's so dumb. All right, what do we got? Ooh, yes please, thank you. And I'm out of water, what a fucking shock. Bless you, Shiv. on to all of that. All right, let me get rid of the memory powder, get this off my person so I can clear up the inventory space. Um, we can go to Alaric, we can go to Horadric. There's so many Ix to whom we can go. Um, blah, 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 blah. Okay. <laughs> that actually worked eventually to clear my brain. Refugee camp. Here we go. Do you have something to say? Yeah, I know. It's terrible. Nope. Hey, dude. I got blood. Yep, I know. It's terrible. Yep. About Lady Beatrice. Okay. Master Alaric, you must know something about Inquisitor Beatrice. She paid me a visit. Beatrice, the council entrusted our affair to Beatrice. It seems they're even crazier than I imagined. What do you mean? What do you know about her? Ever since she appeared several years ago, strange things have been happening. She's had a tremendous career, gathered hundreds of supporters, even including counselors. <laughs> So what's strange? She is ambitious, smart, and quite beautiful. Not my type, but... Her influence over the Council and the Inquisition has grown too strong. There's a secret behind this, I'm sure of it. Corruption? Bribery? Informal arrangements? No doubt, but that's just common stuff. There's something else at work here. That's, that's, that's great. Yeah, yeah. And we're gone. Okay. It's Horadric time. Let's go, buddy. I got news for you. Hey. Boom. Look at this. I took it from the corpse of the vampire. You did it. Amazing. You have helped us enormously. Oh, thank you. Thank you. All our village is grateful to you, our hero. 
What you have done here today will not be forgotten. Achievement unlocked. Vampires are over. That's cool to hear. So. So? My reward. Reward? Oh, sorry. I entirely forgot. I must warn you that the economic situation in our village is not the best. Horadric, my reward! The town's duties have increased and the harvest hasn't been good to us these past few years. Horadric! Here it is. It's a sad day when even heroes can't show compassion for the common villager. Shut up, dude. Vampire's dead! Boom! Done! Also, give me, give me some of my wine that I've given to you. Give it back, please. I'd like to have a little party. And I'd like to be... I would like it to be filled with the rings of onion. Oh, right, this. Shout out, donkey. All right, so it looks like the vampire deal is done. I do need to speak with the uh, Inquisitor asshole about Lady Beatrice. Bear the tincture and apply it to the vampire jawbone. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, my God. So. Oh, okay. And now, let's spray it into both eyes. Jesus. Oh, shit. Ay, ay, ay! My eyes! It's worse than shepherd's garlic! Ay, ay, ay! <laughs> Nothing. Well, Clotho, warm me. Let's try one more time. Damn tincture. Christ on balls! Of course I need another one. God damn it, of course I do. Of fucking course I do. Okay, hold please. I'm gonna have a little party first. Hey, give me money. Hey, take my shit. They're gonna be so fussy about those burgers because they are not... Uh, silver, or whatever. Gold. I kind of feel like I want to hold on to the soup. To tell truth. Whoop. Alright, graveyard fest it is. Eat up! Hello! Welcome back. How are you doing? I believe you were gifted a sub the other night. There was this huge hype train gift sub bomb craziness. And I'm like 99% sure I saw your name on the list of people who got a sub. description <laughs> Oh yay! Excellent. So if you um if you have not already entered the raffle, all subscribers uh get 5 extra tickets. So if you hit exclamation point raffle, you will be entered with uh 6 tickets rather than 1 and we do the drawing today. And that is a reminder to everyone who is a follower. Do hit exclamation point raffle to make sure you're entered into this week's... No. Uh, 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 blah, blah, blah. Humble Bundle Game Giveaway. One of 
that. This. This. Ooh, what do you need? I bet you need, I'm sure you need confidence rolls, right? No, you do not. I don't know what it is that you need then. What's the hold up, bub? Oh shit. Let's get this going then. Sure. And then this. No, where does the um the polishing paste get made? Why am I feeling like it's here? Ah, uh, because it is. Fantastic. Come here. Get on it. Okay. Monitoring all of the things. So I still need to go get more memory tincture though. Uh, we will cook that up. Fabulous. Get to it. Take some water. Get moving on this. If in you don't mind. And I think here. Yep. We can make another bottle of ferment. Ferment. And we can't, oh, no, 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 no. You go. That is such a small amount of booze. I wish it were more. Okay. Another memory tincture, please. Boy. Okay. Oh, shit. And I will check this one out down here. Um, I make silver mead. Polanco, because I'm saving the gold for the beer that the zombie is making. I hope that that answers that question. What's it like? I can't move one to the other. Can't move this to that. Yeah. Okay. okay. Nothing again. Wait, what the hell is that? Finally, okay. You're late. Do you require another lesson in respect? You miserable worms. It's not our fault, mistress. The tongue is much less friendly to vampires these days. The Order of Undead Hunters patrols the night streets with nets to catch bats. 
Yeah, it's a blessing we managed to make it here at all. You useless nobodies. Your endless silly excuses. That's all I ever get from you. Have you wrung anything more from that priest? We've tried everything, mistress, but Alaric is incredibly resistant. Pain, cold, hunger, thirst, nothing works. Then use bloodthirst, you mindless fools. You mean we should turn him? But it's an awful sin, and... Oh, shit. It will be done, mistress. Oh, dagnabbit. I can't get a good screenshot to save my life in this game. Achievement unlocked, mysterious woman. Oh, no, my eyes. It's like I've been staring at the sun for a whole hour. But I've learned something new. I must learn more about that woman. They mentioned the Order of Undead Hunters, so maybe Shepard knows about her. And, of course, Alaric might remember something. Great. Come here, give me your blood. Gotta feed a vampire. I could wait for, shit. For 10 uh, in order to create a bucket. However, um, that feels like I would run the risk of forgetting that that was my goal and then use the blood. Or using the blood. Good enough. Duh. Oh no, wrong. Not yet. Not here yet. Groofy, maybe you should quit your job and become a graveyard keeper because isn't it, isn't it just a fascinating, fascinating world of, of intrigue and vampires? You know, I don't know how well it pays. I mean, I don't know if you'd be making engineer money, but... I have nothing else to say after that. My god, this is just a lot of death solution. I, I have clearly solved death. So yeah, so Polanco, I save um I save the gold hops for the the beer that the zombie makes. I really wish he could make um mead too though, because this process is <sighs> a process. All right. Whoop, pardon me. Wait, what the hell was I making? Where the hell is it? Where? The shit? There. This? Ve no, I don't know, but I'm making it now. Vegetable patty. Yes, please.
All right, so. It's Inquisitor. Shepherd. The Marquis and Alaric. So Marquis and Alaric I could do at the same time. So let's do that first. Excuse me. Excuse me, I gotta drop off blood. Warp's blood again. It tastes like marsh mud. Though it's better than nothing. Alright. I have some new information, Master Alaric, about the vampires who kidnapped you. There was a woman who ordered them to do it and to turn you into a vampire. A woman in a black and gold cloak. Have you ever heard anything about her? I would have remembered if the kidnappers mentioned her, but they didn't. They mentioned ghouls a lot. They said they'd feed me to keep them. Feed me to them if I kept quiet. Wait. They said they'd feed me to them if I kept quiet? How foolish. Every adult knows that ghouls don't exist. I think that woman might be the key to our mystery. Sorry I can't help you. But listen, why do you smell so strange? The thing is, when Lady Beatrice visited me, she... It doesn't matter... Fantastic. Are we done? Yeah, done. Yeah, uh-huh, uh-huh. Great! All right. Uh, I'd like to leave. Hello? Jesus Christ. No, not you, moneylender, you fucking no. All right, Marquis, where the shit are you? Also, is there room to build? There just isn't. Where the hell is he? There he is. Nope, says stand still. Where are we going? Dude, where are we going? Can you take me with you? Hey, here, where are we going? Hey, hey, where are we going? I'm gonna cut him off at the pass. Watch this, I'll take a- eh, The most circuitous route. <laughs> uh, oh, great. Hold on, wait. <laughs> wait. Wait, wait, wait. So Groofy had said, maybe I should quit my job and become a, a graveyard keeper. Or a night watchman. I've always wanted zombie minions. Right, Groofy? Uh, yes, I hope Moo is, is feeling better since yesterday as well. Uh, Groofy says she was, and then my son and I got into an argument and made her brain pain come back. Oh, Groofy, I'm so sorry. And Moo, I'm so sorry. Hug, hugs, hugs. Aggressive, gentle, aggressive shove hugs for Moo. Samalander with the raid. Hello and welcome. Everything is fine indeed. Can our chatters please hit exclamation point raid to greet our visitors to the sandbox? Hello, hello. I am Mia. I am a themed variety streamer, meaning I play a different genre of game depending on the day of the week. Um, Sundays are slow and- Yipes! Oh! And Carol Luna's here. <laughs> I really need to get my neck fixed so that these frights don't- uh, <laughs> Send me into a spasm. Um, you know, slow and steady. Graveyard Keeper. The end. Hello, welcome. Thank you so much uh, for bringing your folks over, Sam Lander. How was RimWorld today? I kept getting notifications that you were playing RimWorld. Like- were you crashing or was Steam just being hyper? Um. Okay, wait, so. Uh, I'm just gonna finish uh, reading what happened in chat before the raiders came and then I will greet all of the raiders individually. Um, Polanco is saying, yes, it's a shame zombies can't make the honey mead. Yes, useless zombies indeed, Polanco, useless. If, if Groomfy ever had zombies, I would hope that they would be more useful than these useless, non-mead-making zombies. 
Goofy saying Moo is reaching XCOM level accuracy and control. Gun to the face, 99% chance hit. She misses. Growface, she's got a headache. Leave her alone. Eastbourne, hello. Intertooth, hello. Caroluna, hello. Matt, hello. Wood H, hello, hello. I'm getting, I'm getting higher and higher. I have to start this lower. Hello. <laughs> and it was Caroluna. Sorry for the fright, <laughs> Eastbourne. Yes, Groofy, that's how I know Caroluna is here as well. The mod he uses is a bit wonky. Oh, so that's why it requires RimWorld restart. So you actually were, Samalander, restarting every time. Okay, thank you. Thanks for the clarification. The bot kept crashing. Boo! Um, Angel is saying, yeah, I saw the Burt bot was working reliably today. And Samalander goes to find some lunch. Burb. Indeed, indeed. Uh, Angel, can we please get shout outs for all of the people? If you would not mind. So we are, are uh, we, we have met a, a lovely Inquisitor lady who is vile and dangerous and likes to spray perfume in places where perfume is not wanted. Um, we are providing blood to a vampire. I'm just trying to think of all the goings on that have been happening. No time for regrets to sir. Excuse me, to survive, we must look to the future. Warn Teodoro about Lady Beatrice. Ah, uh, Keeper, you're just in time. I was just about to visit you. We've had terrible news. The king was in a terrible rage and refused to even speak to my cousin about our bid for clemency. Oh, God. His son's wedding was disrupted. Corrupted? Why do I do that? The bride is dead? Oh, what happened? Inquisitors, a group of Inquisitors led by some Lady Beatrice, accused her of witchery. They produced some evidence, so the court's judgment was swift. That's bad. By the way, that Lady Beatrice you just mentioned paid me a visit. She's looking for you. We've nowhere else to go, so I hope she stops looking for before she finds us here. We'll have to stay here for a long time, maybe forever. How can I help? How can I help? First, we need an imp shoot me in the face. Improved warehouse and an improved cr campfire. And one more tent would be just right. So we can take in more refugees. Mm, that smell, is that close? Where is that coming from? Weird. Ha ha, something happened. Where is it? Let's see. <gasps> Polanco, thank you so much for the follow. I very much appreciate that. Official welcome to the sandbox. Uh, Angel, oh wait, A Angel is, um, I think, catching people up. Mia recently uncovered a vampire, so now she's building a refugee camp. <laughs> Ray. Boo bot says moo. Carolyn is saying, yeah, lots of restarts today. Angel, thank you for doing the shout outs. <laughs> Oh, Eastbourne, I didn't know that you streamed. So you were last playing chess, but that was a while ago. Oh, you're welcome for the shout out. Always happy to shout people out. Attention must be paid to all the awesome folks. Oh my God, look at this to-do list. Christ. Oh, and I sold the silk. I, I hate myself. I mean, it's not like I don't have a bajillion dollars. Damn it! All right. Ass load of flitch. Butt ton of stone. Silk. Flitch stone silk. Okay. I mean, this is... Honestly, they are so fucking needy and demanding. I know I say it all the time, but it's true all the time. All right. Veggie patties. Done. Oh, wait. I, I need to. I need to. No. 
Yes. All right. Uh, I think here would be, yep, Lich. Stone, oh, that's far too much stone. And the silk that I so impetuously got rid of. Ever so impetuously. Hey, get rid of those dr jugs. Do something with them. Thank you. Okay. Where did I put the silk? Is it down here or in the church? Oh, three. Mm hmm. Of course. God damn it. God damn it. All right. So I need to wait for this day in order to get more silk. Phenomenal. It's just phenomenal. Out of my way. Leave me alone. Busy. Got stuff to do. Beat it. All right. Let's go get it. Better? Christ! Improve campfire again. Build one more tent. All right. Well, their happiness needs to go up. Improve warehouse. Where's the... Okay. Oh, and I will need... Okay. I will need four wooden sticks. Hold on. I cannot believe I sold all that silk. Ugh! Whoop. Yeah, the environmental um, sounds that they have added to this game are, are just really bring the, bring the quality way up. No, leave me alone. I mean, yes, that's good. I need blood, but leave me alone. Okay, that's good. So what other things can I make? What other dishes? To use up all of my shit. Okay. All right. So let's make some more bread for right now. Man, I wish I could sell that, honey. Oh! Okay. Angel's saying the new poll is up. Everyone can vote on what Mia focuses on next. So far, 
people are voting for you to do the warehouse next, but there's about, wait a minute, two minutes left in the poll. Uh, Grimpy saying, phenomena, do, 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 Eastbourne. Oh, thank you so much for continuing your gift sub. That is amazing. I really, really appreciate that. Thank you so much. And thank you for the follow. Eastbourne. Enter the raffle, exclamation point raffle. You'll get six tickets. We we give away a, a Humble Bundle game from my collection um, on Sundays. So exclamation point raffle. Yay. Yay, seriously, thank you so much, Eastbourne. That is really, that is really, really nice. Okay, tie between focusing on the warehouse or the campfire, but people definitely want to see one of those two things. So I think I still need silk, though. Groupie's saying just about all of Twitch has a, has a gift sub to Mia now. Yeah. Um, Friday was, was, well, my mouth is still hanging open. Just this uh, insane outpouring of hype train gift sub love that was difficult to process. The generosity was outstanding. Um, or I don't even know what my words are. See, I'm trying to talk about it again. It was amazing, and I'm so grateful. And thank you. Thank you all again. Because holy shit. What, what am I doing? They want me to focus on things. All right. So silk. I'll need silk, though, regardless. So it has to wait until this day for me to get more silk. Um, because... Whatever needs to be made requires it. And I don't think the campfire can be upgraded at this point. But let me, let me pop up there. And thank you for running the poll, Angel. All right. Oh, shit. Yes. Okay. Tent. The the campfire is is as as upped as it can get, I believe, and then I have to wait for the silk for the warehouse for sure. I will grab sticks though, and then we just have to wait until the refugee happiness goes up. Let me see if there's anything I can do here at the Yeah, the fire is is all it is. Uh Yep. Yep. Improve warehouse, build one more tent. Yep, okay. Oh! Polanco, no worries. So it's a giveaway. Basically, what, what you do is if you hit that exclamation point raffle, um, you get entered into a giveaway because I have a whole pile of games that I got from Humble Bundle. And I'm giving them away to folks um, every week. So that's a raffle is a giveaway. If that, I don't know. I hope that explains it. It's like a free chance to win a game. What are we what are we getting stuck on here? Oh, because I took all of the flitch. That's what the deal is. All right. Let me give back Thirty-six flitch. That is in the wrong place. Hopefully, it gets used because gross. Um, six. I only have two, so I will need to buy two more wooden sticks. I could grab them, but I plan on going into town uh, to talk to. Uh, damn it. To talk to the shepherd. So while I'm there, I will get some sticks. And I do need to talk to the Inquisitor also, as it turns out. And I 
I'm almost at his day. Or, no, it is his day. <laughs> ah! Oh, God! Thank you. Thank you. Kara Luna, thank you. Jody, hello! How are you doing? How is your world? All right. Dead horse. No. All right. So, oh shit, though, I need to for sure talk to the Inquisitor. Well, fuck it, I'm here. I gotta talk to the shepherd real quick. Always forget where he is. Oh. There was a long line here. Corey, Adam, Miller, Merchant, and five others. All elegantly dressed with flowers and gifts. Oh, they're here to woo Rose. Shepard appears, pushes everyone to the side, takes Rose in his hands, kisses her lips, and carries her away. Right, it's like a lottery. Exactly, Eastbourne. You get tickets, and one ticket has a winning number. There you go. Okay. So up here, come here, you about the mysterious woman. Don't leave home without your weapon. What, your home without weapon, Keeper? These days we must be on the lookout. Evil is everywhere. No kidding. Tell me, what do you know about a woman in a black and gold cloak? Is she a werewolf, an evil spirit, a rider with burning skull instead of his head? She might be a vampire, but I'm not sure. Then let's go kill her, dissect her, and find out. Well, she was around 30 years ago, but who knows where she is now or if she's even alive. A black and gold cloak, you say? Hmm, I remember one fresco. I always admired it when I visited the town cathedral as a child. It was called Master versus Vampire Queen. And that queen wore a cloak like the one you mentioned. Vampire queen? Um, that sounds terrifying. Who else might know about the vampire queen? Who is so comfortable dealing with the undead? Jerry. My balls. Yep, whatever. Give me shit. Give, give me, I need sticks. Oi. Stick me. All right. And, oh dear. And something else to look at with the witch's eye. Tress was napping beside the fire, surrounded by hundreds of origami paper rabbits. Hmm, this was recent. Tress was already old. Corey and some man from town are watching from a distance. The man looks like a doctor. The doctor leaves. Corey suddenly rushes over to Tress, gathers all the rabbits, and throws them into the fire. Tress awakens, shouts, and burns his hands, trying to save the rabbits from the fire. Okay. Inquisitor. Not now, not now. No time, no time. Oh, just, just a little bit of time. Thank you. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Can I go around? I can. 